Hello, YouTube. Well, we just took out the mage and concluded that the crossbow is the most overpowered weapon for the fighter. Excuse me. There we go. I actually didn't even take any damage. That's freaking rocking, man. I thought I got plenty of health. I'm sure more boneheads are gonna come any sec. I don't think so. <laughs> Well, we're in a mouse at least muslims. A secret Kinda cool. Oh no. Guys, like, <laughs> oh, my God, no, going out there. With me. Hey, we got that one finally. Any place that has more chests, I don't think so. Now kind of stuck. Oh, he's taken care of. Ow, not. Boom. Yes. Whoa. I think that was a piece that just flew out. Oh my god. Oh, doing good. Make a progress. There's plenty of health in here. What a weird thing for a crit. But cool! Sword ready. My got about. What? It goes to a bloody part too! Oh no, what's in the bloody part too? Oh, what's in the bot? All two. Crack. two. Oh, yeah, these are the guys that were unfortunately not able to. I am strong. That took a lot. Um, do we have any batteries? I see you shifting at me, how dare you. Shift, yeah. Or oh, I must become the immortal tank. I have to actually see that.
fucking right to the way. And I don't want to waste my three shot. Yeah. Why can't you just die like the rest of them? Freaking focused. Cause this guy. Switches. I'm gonna say this. Creepy church music. I hear something moving. Let's deal ourselves, ladies, because this one's going to be a handful. <laughs> Expert. Now this one has the Wrath Bridge, which if you don't know what the Wrath Bridge is, it is um the cleric or the good version that you play of this guy. And what it does is it shoots a projectile that floats for like a second or two, then splits into four spirits that can go through walls, it can rip enemies, multiple enemies, it's actually the most powerful weapon in Hexen. I mean, others could say this or that, but... Until they face a full Rockford shot, I, I don't think they know. Okay, cool. We just took him out. Oh, got a green battery. I don't particularly like this. Icon on the defender, that'll be useful. Got more flashettes. I want to say that this guy was like the good guy. Okay, um. I guess we gotta go back. Although it sounds like the entrance turned into a freaking crusher, that's, that's not gonna be fun. It could be fun for anyone. It could be for me. It could be for you. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Ha! Ah. I was wound up and ready. Oh, no! Okay, I think the only real criticism that I can really notice from this sword is about half as fast as the little crystal sword. Uh... 
Oh no. Let's just set my mouse. There we go. Oh, he ex he blow the explosion. Cool. Yeah, I know you're in that security. Get out of there. Oh, there's two. Dude, yeah, what were you two doing? Who knows? These creatures are weird. Uh, up there. Trying to look for any more little secrets. Nope. Little stone step away. Okay. No. Yes. <laughs> ah, the sound of birds. Sound I don't need to get. Okay, how do I get back up? <clears throat> oh no! I'm trapped! This is their plan all along! They're going to trap me in here. This is my tomb! Ha, <clears throat> ah, jokes on them, I got this, but I really want to save that. I that there's somewhere. Ah, there we go. See? I knew there was a switch. Oh my god. Long elevator. Pretty cool. A crypt that leads to an underground. And we are set. I don't. Oh uh, no, it is working. Why were those guys defending this? I thought it would have been something a little stronger. Cause I think we're going. Yep, we're pushing this video into overtime. Why? I want to see what's at the end of this. Um, is that you want to be ready for almost anything? I kind of hope that the Mystic Urns do that one thing that they did before. You never know. And I'm gonna have these ready. Okay, sweet. Eat it, Korax! Oh no. Oh no! I'm okay with expanding a little blue.
Ah, die. Fuck, right, here he comes again. Okay, um... How I want to... Oh, he's trying to get me. Let's send out our guy. Hopefully he can do something. Or he'll just walk away. Ho oh, ho! Okay. We defeated him. Ah, uh, we just about made it to having um 400 health. Ugly. Ugly. What's that? I think the RPG mod made it too easy to take him down. And again, that crossbow. Oh, oh he summoned. Uh. Fire pit. Well then. Uh. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> With a scream of agony, you are wrenched from this world into another. Every part of your body withered into misted fire. When your vision clears, you find yourself standing in a great hall. Filled with ghostly echoes and menacing shadows. In the distance, you could see a risen dais. Raised dais, sorry. And upon it, only a source of light in this world. This can only be the Chaos Sphere, the source of Korax's power. With this, you could create worlds or destroy them. By rights of battle and conquest, it is yours, and with trembling hands, you'll reach to grasp it. Perhaps now a new player will join the cosmic game of power, like the pawn who is promoted to queen. Suddenly, the very reaches of the board seem to be within your grasp. But there are other players mightier than you, and who can know their next moves? <laughs> well then, we were so close, but we defeated Korax. Wait, is there anything, anything more? Nope, that's it. <laughs> that's the end. We beat Action with the brutal RPG. Okay, so this game is actually a really fun game. Especially if you like old fantasy, almost like Dungeons and Dragons, but with a first person twist. And I could have went vanilla, but I wanted something a bit more spicy, because I like RPGs. And I kind of wanted a bit more uh, visceral, a bit more intriguing. Plus, I found that one spot where you could farm experience if you have a mod that allowed it. Hexen on its own, no mods or anything. Great game, it's a challenge. Um, I highly re recommend playing the cleric. The cleric has the best weapon, like I said. Wrathverge, you can't really lose with that, except for maybe against the Heresy Arc. And then you just gotta be careful when he pops the shield. Maybe the Centaurs and Slothars, or anything that reflects projectiles too, because if they reflect it, well, you're in trouble. Either way, good game. 
fun and true story I actually well, just beat it in about two days a little less than two days actually that's how good this was I wanted to keep recording over and over try to get the best I can out of it it's a fun game if you could get it on Steam or wherever I highly recommend it it's worth it sure the graphics are dated and such compared to today's standards but actually I think that's some of the charm that it has mod wise for Hexen uh, I mean brutal RPG is fun but eh I might do a separate video kind of messing with the other characters because I mean we just played the game so I do want to try another RPG mod but kind of make it much harder I want it to be more RPG-esque since you go between walls we'll see anyways that was Hexen uh, I believe the second of the Serpent Riders has failed to my hands and I got the uh, Chaos Sphere I got even more power <laughs> um, I might do a little bit more with Hexen because I mean like I said it's a fun game I can't really stop if you guys enjoyed this journey and you want to see more why not leave a like also subscribe and hit the notification bell and if you want to help me out a cup of coffee is always great maybe a patreon uh, both are linked down below but most of all thank you very much for joining me on this journey and hopefully you take a look at it it might be worth it I think it's only like a couple bucks maybe five bucks on Steam but that's going to be it for this video this run we have conquered it